Okay, it is Monday, April 4th, 2016. We're at 28266 Hidden Lake Drive. And as you can see, lawn's landscaped very well. Give you a quick look around some of the other homes. We'll do a complete tour of the inside. The house itself was set up actually as a rental, which is nice because they have everything inside set up that way. And it's got a nice beach feel to it. A lot of windows, a lot of light. A lot of upgrades like crown molding and plantation shutters. And they were right, everything is super clean. As you can see walking in, two story, you have a loft area. And the stairs. There's a first floor master. And then second floor, there's two bedrooms and full bath. And then the master has a full bath and then there's a half bath as well. Dining area. A lot of nice architectural detail to it as well. And kitchen area. And then outdoor pool area, which we'll take a walk out there. We'll go back through the dining room into the kitchen. Nice tall doors, all eight foot doors. kitchen area nice cabinets but everything's included as well you literally and being from Germany in the summertime we have uh, German tourists a lot of them come to Naples and Benita Southwest Florida in the summertime the people that owned it actually set up a book that is completely tells everyone uh, all the rules and regulations of the house, which you can use as well, which is which is kind of cool. Family room, like I said, nice beach feel to it, and then back outside. Then into, but like I said, the architectural detail, the crown molding around the doors and crown molding in the master. Furniture's nice. Everything's super clean. A lot of light comes in. Plantation shutters. And then nice big bathroom. Huge closet, enormous walk-in closet. Again, a lot of light coming in, tall ceilings. Shower. And like I said, the Master closet is enormous. Be another bedroom. Nice big bathtub, two sinks. to the outdoor area. Big Lanai area. 
Nice fire drought here as well. And nice pool with a lake view and the fountain in the background, which is nice. So you have the pool and then you also you get some nice privacy with the trees and uh, the lake being in the background, but you don't have neighbors right behind you. There's some preserve back there. Then we'll go ahead and go up to the second floor. Two more bedrooms and a full bath. Actually, before we go on the second floor, I want to show you the half bath on the first floor. And a linen closet. And then the laundry. The garage is nice too because they put a screen door going into the garage, which you can actually, during the winter, you can keep the garage door open. You have the screen, you have some nice cross breeze going in. Really did a great job of extra storage as well and utilize the space really well. You know, it's a brand new water heater and the instant hot water on it. Now we'll go ahead upstairs. Left area is nice. Another bed up here as well. And more storage up here. Like I said, they did a good job with storage. And here's a view back downstairs. Nice big opening with pocket doors. So you can get privacy here as well. Guest room to the right. Tall ceilings up on the second floor as well. Another full bath on the second floor. And then you got the last bedroom. And some nice views from here. And then attic access, more storage. Overall, very nice house. Don't think it's gonna stay on the market very long. Uh, I think it would be uh, make a really great rental and uh, eventually a great place for you guys to have a place to come down to during the winter.